Hello guys, welcome back to another Death Frontier 2 video. My name is Jimmy Shreds and we are back again with another episode of Beginner's Guide Project Zero New Beginning. Uh, so this is the gameplay. Uh, I'm getting, uh, I'm leveling and showing you and explaining you everything uh, that you need to know, everything that you can learn. Think of this as uh, I have a lot of game knowledge, but I'm experiencing... Uh, everything that you are because i started from the like back again like six years ago when i started playing this game so i'm literally sharing my experience and learning the things that changed as a um, new experience shall i say i'm uh, getting the same experience as you are as the new players to see how leveling works and everything i'm explaining you so don't want to keep it any longer i'm gonna go <coughs> straight into the game we're gonna go do some uh, lunar event missions first also for those of you who joined my goal uh, those of you who joined my membership uh, on youtube i really appreciate you thank you very much for all the support if you want to support me on my youtube you can do so by clicking join or i'll leave in the description down below the membership link so you can feel free to support if you want and also you can feel free to leave a uh, feedback uh, about that is it like too expensive like what do you think please do not hesitate because I really care about what do you think guys i don't want prices to be too high and such okay let's get to the game we are gonna need some antibiotics need three of them and we're gonna need some need to get there asap uh where is it where is it okay uh what else we need nine mil yeah, there we go uh and get this for the xp and let's get going wait they're both with the xp right more than this one Never mind. Answer that. And let's get going to the Dalbo. I'm gonna play the music. I completely forgot. There we go. Alright, do we have fuel? We do. Let's go. So, for those of you uh, who still uh, didn't play, we have a lunar event running which gives you these buffs. I highly advise you to do this. Uh, do these missions that I'm doing uh at family residence this is where it's located every monday world reset happens so the locations of the buildings change all map layout will change from the outside so this is where it's located today so i highly advise you to do these missions you get envelopes so you can grab the items plus you get a ton of xp to level characters now watch this that's a lot of xp guys look at that There we go, level 28, guys. Just like that. Uh, okay, we got that. There's gonna be a world reset in a, in about a minute. We're gonna go wait a bit. We're gonna loot here and see what do we get here from the items. Okay, we're gonna level here, quick shot for sure. So we got some zombie here. There we go. Uh, where is it? Get the total of five so we can aim as fast as possible. Then we're gonna level headhunter after that. Okay. There we go. Uh so okay, that's fine. Alright, let's see what can we find here from the items while we're waiting. Mm, I guess leave that. I know some people don't need damaged items so they can craft some things. Puzzle. That is the same one. Probably nothing here. Oh, damn, all car parts so far. And okay, well, we said happened. We can do so by logging out. Getting in again. Bang. All right, let's see. Let's see, what are the, the items? Okay, time to go there. Actually, you know what? People, somebody else will check and post it for us, I'm pretty sure, on the Discord, so we don't have to go there. We can go inside of the elbow. I'm gonna check what we sold. We're waiting. Okay, nice. We made some cash. Let's go. That's awesome. That's awesome. Okay, we got 30 envelopes here. So how many we are missing? We are missing a few to craft. Okay, awesome. We're missing uh 
Okay, so what we're gonna go for is a question. I, I like uh, this. It's really hard to get feet with the uh, with the XP and especially these stats. But then this damage is like very important as well. So I'm most likely gonna go for the head first. Okay, let's see what we have here. Five, five, six antibiotics again. Okay, awesome. It's just a small bit. Okay, what else? What else do we need? Okay, so Rabbit Steel, which we cannot craft. We need a few of them. Okay, going back there. And the juicy XP again. Uh, and after that, we're gonna go straight to the. We're gonna get straight to the bossing. Actually. Oh, look at that. 10. And five. Oh, what are you doing there, guys? 10%. No, no questions about that. I need to buy some ammo for sure first. Some energy drinks so we can run faster. <laughs> I'll also check the price of... Oh my god, I forgot Orangeizer. I, I forgot about that item. I need to check. I need to check. Uh... What are you after? Okay, done. It's not safe here. I really forgot about that item. I need to check what's the price of that. The thing uh, with the Orangeizer, it's like really good. It's really, really good. Just a second. Bang. Get that. You got this. Incredible the item. The thing is, with the Orangeizer, it gives you XP and movement speed, but you, uh, you take more damage. So it's a... Uh, it's like a really good item, but if you do mistakes, you can lose a lot of XP. That's the issue with that. We're gonna go back to the base. Mm. Man, those shoes are calling me. I like the speed, but then again, I like the damage as well. But yeah, pretty much in this episode, we're going to be fighting bosses again. That's how it's going to go. Okay. Um, right. Right. Got to do the craft. Turn inside. Um, man, oh man. Hmm. I mean, usually when we're fighting the bosses, hmm. we'll be able to craft both for sure. Like we have 80. Yeah, let's not wait for too long. Let's not wait for too long. We're going to go for the head first. Let's go. We get. Damn, that's awesome, guys. Look at that. Oof, yes. Okay, guys. More XP and everything. Awesome head. Transfer, transfer that. Need some ammo. 20 gauge. I'm gonna check the orangeizer. Get that. Okay, that's enough ammo. Bandages. And buy some antibiotics for ourselves because we're bossing. And okay, somebody bought that. Bandage. Uh, uh, we need two. What else we need? Need some iodines. Two as well. Oh, by this. Uh, and we need some anxiety. There we go. By this. They're not hard to get, but gotta have some on us. Okay, and orangeizer. I think it's like that. It's 3k for one. I guess it's worth it. We'll take one. Get energy drinks. 10 minutes. Ah, we'll do it. Okay, we're ready to roll, guys. So, we're gonna do this one first and this one. Then we're going for the boots after that, for sure. Now, watch this. 
you take 25% more income damage, but you get 20% XP and movement speed, which is insane. And um, I advise you to do this when you're doing missions, which I forgot to mention. And yeah, I completely forgot about that. Th that's what I'm saying, you know, th those are the new items. Back then when I was leveling, those items didn't exist. So I completely forgot about those items. It's just free XP like that. Okay, what's there? But heavy mind, as you said, you take more damage, so be careful. Now we have min minus, no, plus 21 incoming, sorry. Minus is like good thing. Right, let's go get these guys. One. Dude, look at that shotgun. Look at that knockback stun, man. That's insane. Awesome. Okay. Awesome. And are we gonna level up from this? We should, right? Yes, sir. Got it. Okay, going for the next one. Uh, this one. Okay, next skill we're going for is hunter which gives damage versus mutated this is where it gets where it gets uh you know where where with the damage you'll see like is really really good let me start okay just a second guys okay hunter and it's located here there we go five damage versus mutated let's go everything else maxed yes sir okay so the uh hunter uh is Damage versus mutated, which are all bosses. So this is how I like to play. Some people will like to go um, the other way of uh, leveling skills. I prefer to go this way, like the way I did it, as, as explained to you guys. So always, I always focus sprinter, then I go like marksman, then I go reloading, and then I go, sorry, um, when you're leveling, sprinter, fast learner, marksman, reloading, quick shot. So that's the like the priority you want to max like. So when you can max sprinter level, put the level into the sprinter. When you can put point into fast learner, put the point into fast learner. When you can put point into marksman, put it into the marksman. When you can put point into reloading, put it into reloading, and then quick shot. But yeah, usually people like to go for the hunter below level. Um, like they usually go like around 25, 30. So now I'm going to get thir uh, from 31 to 35. Uh, would be different as well. I wouldn't be going for quick shot if I had a weapon expert as well, which I do not have. As I explained, why not? Wanna see like uh, what type of weapons we're gonna get later on? We have, we still have a free skill reset. Uh, everybody has a one free skill reset. Those of you who are uh, new to the game and you didn't uh, skill reset yet, uh, still. And even the old players, you, sh you should still uh, have one free skill reset because we've been given one uh, when the level fifty I think got out. So if you still didn't use it since then, you should have it. All right, almost there. And yeah, don't go to this place, guys. This is the hardest building in the game. When you see the buildings with the red names, that means danger. Run, don't go in there. This is like endgame building. But yeah, I, I, I uh, don't like that it's located here. Should be located. Where is the removal now? Oh wait. Oh, there we go. It's here. But yeah, I don't know uh, why they moved it here. But hey, there we go. Let's go get those ten envelopes. This one should have mutations, right? Yeah, I mean mutations. They're not mutants. They're, 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 the damage versus impact is still working against them. What I'm saying is like they have more HP. They deal more damage and such. Like, as you can see, this guy, his blood, he deals, uh, if I'm right, it's 50% more damage. I'm not sure, is it 25 or 50? I just say it's 50. But yeah, bloody enemies are quite dangerous. And Jimmy. Okay. I'll take that. They're stuck somehow. What? Why do you stuck against the boss? What's wrong? Hmm, that's weird. Yeah, we're not gonna use that. 
this move here. No point in playing a game like that. Okay. See how much easier it is when you have a proper weapon and uh, you know everything else. Another one missed. And if you miss some shots, don't be don't be sad, worried. Things like that happen. Oh man, I'm still going against the boss. I didn't mean to do that. Come here, guys. Yeah, just repeat what I'm doing. Keep the distance. Like with the shotgun, the shotgun has the highest stun duration and the uh, knockback distance. So it's really noob friendly in terms of that. Okay, got him. There's one more which we're gonna kill for the XP. Oh, look at that, another one. Now let's say no to that. This one has more HP because uh, he is green, which means irradiated. It's 20% more HP. Okay, back to the double. Then we're gonna go to Haverbrook. We'll do the tactic when I, uh, that I explained to you about looting. Get that, get out. Okay, 39k out of... Okay, we just need 70 more K for the level up. We'll take that. I might buy another Orangeizer. So we can get those uh, levels faster uh, at the bosses. Now we're about to go fight the bosses. Okay. Like that. But yeah, the the rest of the episode is uh, fighting bosses now. I had to do these purple zones for the uh, you know for those envelopes so we can craft items. If we see another purple zone on the way, we're gonna do it as well. But if it's too hard one, yeah, we'll have to skip it. Anyway, I'm a loot goblin, guys. I gotta loot. Okay, I'll take that, I guess. Some XP right there. Um, I'm not gonna pick that up. It's not worth much. I think, at least. Back then, it was when I was playing, it was not worth much. I'll need to check. Like, when I was low level, what I mean. Like, when I was still leveling some new characters and such. <clears throat> and no chainsaws and mill users use whiskey, so okay, nice. So, memo for us go. Right, I'm gonna go straight to the heavy book, Willow and Field, though. Have for one more travel, I think. Yeah, that. Oh, well, we have for two for sure. Okay, don't forget to get missions here. Always when you start. You know, um, in Delbo it's not worth it because we're not at the Delbo anymore. But here, always go in, start all missions, and you got all the missions from this building. Okay, now let's read that. Okay, listen to that so we can drop that. Good amount of XP right there. This the quarter because this for a survivor's you. And there's our account stash, man. I'm lost. Um, uh, answer that. Answer that. Put that here. So I'm gonna get rid of that. We're definitely gonna be carrying something like that for the bosses that we're about to fight. They got that. I might get some ammo as well. Mm, we need some antibiotics. You gotta be ready for the fight. Oh my god, there's a traitor. Come on, we just need two. I'm oh not lucky. Uh, okay, some ammo. Should be fine. Are present and accounted for, but seem to 
We'll take more, just in case. Alright, good on that. Uh, oh, I'll take that. We have two of these. One Orangeizer. We get two, actually. You know what? We'll get two. Okay, we are ready to roll, guys. It's here. Painkillers. Right, let's do this, guys. We're gonna go to level 25 and 30 area. Oh, damn. Actually, not many. Well, we'll try. We'll try to do this here. What we have. Oh, man, the map is looking uh, rather not more for the lower levels but it's fine we'll start doing here 25 and such there you go uh pop these two and let's roll oh that's a bad i might I missed okay we're in here I don't really want to take any uh, damage right now because enemies deal more damage to us. Okay. See what enemy we're about to fight here. Take that. And. It's a creep. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. So this guy, keep the distance. Don't be close to him. He has the longest reach in the game. And in terms of melee attacks, kill the child zombies. Let's uh, leave some ammo in the inside of the shotgun in case you get stuck or something. I'll keep the distance and reload here. You don't want to get inside of this smoke, otherwise you'll get irradiated. You get radiation, sorry, which you don't want. Kill, kill these guys if we can. Okay, that's not good. Knock him back. Eat. Reload here. A lot of zombies coming in through the doors. For some reason. Run. Hit again. This. Hmm, interesting. So many. Okay. Do it again. And he spawns worms. I forgot to say that as well. There you go. He's down. Oh. I wanna die here okay i'm gonna pull the worms to the other side right here In one minute in purple zones we can get the loot from this guy oh man zombies really low us uh come on i'll take that that's elite loading times come on game uh i'll take that for now i guess I don't know what's going on, but DF3 has really bad loading times so far, like recently. Really bad. Okay. Uh, I guess scrap. Okay, uh, purple zones. We'll reset soon. Uh, what is it? Another one. Uh, I mean, the same one again. This one has to go. This guy on the yeah okay, she's on the left. Okay. Um, this this. Okay. There we go. What do we get? Crap, I guess. Wait for the boss. But in those puzzle boxes, you know, you might get lucky. Oh, we radiated Spitter. She has a lot of HP. You can use these boxes, guys. With the cover, so the speed cannot get you. Did you see what I'm doing? This is not any kind of a bug or exploit. It's just, you know, as it should be. You cannot go through the walls and objects. Kill the enemy. Okay. Let's kill this. 
Kill her as well. We don't want to have anybody bodying us while we're fighting her. Okay. I'm back again here and we are alone with her. Okay, not so long. Wait for her to speed so we can reset her so she does not do the attack. Reload here. She might speed on us. That's bad. We need to use Brinskit, otherwise if we get hit, we're dead. Brinskit ASAP. There we go. Yeah, loading times are really horrible. You know what's going on with their servers currently. Okay. Don't wanna do that. Don't get too close like what I did. That was really bad for me. Okay. You can hit me here. Oh, okay, no. I was not sure. I guess she would be able to. Yeah, if I was that far away, she would be able to. And when you're fighting the enemy, don't turn your back on the on the uh, doors. You always want to be able to see the doors. Remember that. Because sometimes it gets bugged and you do not hear the sound. I don't know for what reason that is, but... You see that? No sound. You, you heard the zombie sound, but you didn't hear the sound of the doors, as we did now when we returned the, uh, at the door, when we were looking at the door. There we go. Man, that's a lot of XP. Let's go. Uh, 13 incoming. It's better for sure than what we have, right? Inventory, yeah, dude. That nice upgrade. All right, that. And though we'll craft a better uh, body piece in the event for sure. Get this bed. Yeah, let's go. Yeah, the, the zombies, dude. That's that's insane, man. It's it's. I think it's it's not the. The issue with those zombies, it's not that it's hard. I mean, you just deal like them. That's that's not really hard. The issue is it gets quite annoying. There's a, and then people mess up because of that. Heal silver dragons. I'm pretty sure we cannot do that. Uh, Because, yeah, just... We do not have enough mobility. That's that's like... We have level 1... Level 16 uh, shoes, level 1 legs, and... Literally just 10 jog speed here, so we're gonna hard skip that. This one gives Uzi, and that's it. No purple zone for us. Okay. What do we get here? Some XP. XP. Touch that. Going up to check if there is a boss. Is yes. Let's go. Let's see what's the boss, guys. And that's hysteric. As soon as you hear that static sound, you know that's a hysteric in the room. Th this is the most squishy boss in the game. But here's one uh, thing about him. He goes invisible for a short period of time. Like, we'll see, like. You see him? So I'm behind. Get him. That's him. He's, like, not fast. He's really easy. Just don't get hit by him. Let's wait for those times where he goes uh, visible. In my opinion, this is one of the easiest bosses in the game. It's just, it, it's just that it's annoying. That's that's the only part about it. Like, cause you cannot shoot all the, all the time. But, but it is what it is, eh? Slows the, uh, game a bit. So, where is he? There we go. Dodge that. I don't know if I said uh, about the stunning bosses. Always time that. 
Like, you cannot stun the bosses for longer than, I think the maximum is 2.5 seconds, is the longest stun you can reach on the bosses, if I remember right, unless they've changed it. And you can stun the boss every 3 seconds. Or a four, not 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 one hundred percent sure on that. So, don't call me on that. It's three or four every three or four seconds. Okay, nothing here. Let's let's check these since we're here. Uh, okay, take that. It's free XP right there. But a hysteric is a, uh, you know, very squishy, uh, very squishy boss, and so because he doesn't have much uh, HP, he's not gonna give you a lot of XP. So have that in mind. Let's check that, I guess, as well. Uh, where is it? Is it downstairs here? Okay, we'll go there. check but uh you can find you see like those uh okay good scrap money but you see those recordings that we found this literally like um explaining like what happened in the in the town like how everything happened and so by finding those recordings uh you get to know how and why what happened in the game Okay, going to level 30 zone soon. Alright, player as market, let's go. Let's see what's the boss here. Oh, twin. Oh, ho, ho. there we go. Yeah, we're gonna get out. Don't want to get stuck and killed by her. And take the mission while we're doing so. So, what are you seeing, guys? I'm gonna clear the zombies here. I'm not gonna even play with delagging them. If I had enough damage, I, I would be able to door kill her. But that's not the case here. You see that? She's spitting those flies. So, if you get hit by those flies, yeah, she can deal quite a lot of damage with that. Ah, we're gonna re enter. We'll need to kill some enemies. Okay. Child zombie is the most important. Okay. Enter again. I would uh, show you the tech. I'll show you the tactic. What you can do. Okay, just a second. So when she's spitting, go to the right. Look at that. Just go to the right. He cannot hit you. And when she's chasing you, just run away from her. And just keep repeating what I'm doing. You can shoot her here if you want, but it's preferably the best thing to do to shoot her while she's uh, spitting. And just keep repeating that. Just always move to the right when she spits. It's really not hard. Go. Just go around in the circle. Uh, she has quite a lot of HP. Just to let you know on that. Always advise you to leave some bullets in your. Oh, we got a zombie behind us. I always advise you to leave some uh, bullets inside of your, uh, your gun, just in case you're stuck for some reason. I don't know why. Why is she stuck? Okay, that was weird. And both of these heads count as a headshot. Just to let you know, guys. Got another enemy. That's a child zombie. Out of all enemies, got out two child zombies. So great. Get hit by that. On a bit. She has a slow attack speed, so that's good. You know, she cannot hit us very fast. Where's the child zombie getting stuck on? 
that's that's the issue with the objects that's kind of what i hate with so many furnitures in this game i think that's a really bad design because enemies get stuck and you just lose the sight of the enemy and they just get they hit you out of nowhere because they just you know get unstuck that's the big issue in my opinion so watch out for that you see that she got stuck again i don't know on what another child zombie and child zombies are literally the most annoying uh, enemies here in terms of the infected trust me on that like when you get to high levels those little kids are oof, a big problem big issue the guy look at that again let me it's another one What is, why is she getting stuck? What's what's wrong? That, that's I, I have no explanation. I don't know why is that happening. I have I have no clue, guys. No explanation on this one. Something's wrong with the furniture here. Okay, a lot of scrap money. Almost almost level up. Very close. Okay, another one. Spitter again. Get get rid of our biggest enemy. that and as you can see if you turn your back on the spitter you can see like when you see the green or green on the walls like reflection for her spit you know she's spitting so you can do it as well like that if you want like hey, that like child zombies all the way touch that but reload speed is very important guys like reloading on all kinds of guns you see why because the enemies will be getting uh, through the doors on the, uh, the worst moment. Wait for that, so we can cancel her. There we go. Okay, good scrap. Always go for the second loot spot, don't forget. Dead. Soon level up. Yep. Maybe one more boss, depends which type of enemy it is. We still didn't see uh, Tangel and Titan, but uh, I think I ought to be skipping Tangel because my I just don't have enough mobility, guys. Like it just that's this most likely what's gonna happen. I just don't see uh I'll go here. I just don't see uh, me doing this with uh, the amount of mobility that I have. Just Titan, maybe Tangel. Oh, I'm not sure, man. I'll equip the enemies first. Okay, that's kind of bad. Okay, we're good, we're good. Reload here. So many enemies. Spawn him there. Run again. Now, it's nice when you time things right, when you know how things work, it's really easy. I can dodge if he attacks me. Oh, nice. Zombie to block him. Awesome. Run again. Wait, he's oh! Yeah, he's not dead here. We wanna kill him as soon as possible, because when he drops on the ground, he recovers HP. This is when they're kind of healing. Okay. Ammo. Okay. We're about to level up. Awesome. And so many enemies. Look at that child zombie. Nice. We got the first armor. Come on, guys. Let's level up. 
Loot, 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 come on. Nice, good scrap. I mean, it's superior, but I'll take it. This is the first armor we found. Hey, that's not bad, actually, guys. It's actually not bad. We might use it, actually. I'm actually going to use it. Mm, eight incoming. Slower incoming, though, but... I mean, armor durability and absorption, that's quite kind of low. But still, we can survive with that. I, I do not advise you to use the armors for regular boss hunting. Uh, Cause... You gotta repair the armor and that can be quite uh, costly. Especially for the new players. So leather jacket will do fine for now. I'm thinking maybe to go for it, but we didn't take any damage so far from the bosses. So maybe no point. I'd rather have more incoming damage. My boss here, get out. Got two bosses here. And Tangerine, there we go. Oof, oof, oof. How fast is she? And I forgot. Oh, there's gonna be bad. I mean, we can die here. We can die here. We got level. Whoa, 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 whoa. She fast. Oh, man. She fast. Forgot. Forgot how fast she is. Oh, yeah. Oh, man, is she fast. Oh, that's bad. I need to kill these enemies if I'm playing to fight her. Round. Oh, 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 oh. We do not have... Oh, and our energy drink and the um, orange eyes just ran out. Oof, man, we cannot fight her. No, not enough mobility. Impossible. There is no way that I just... I don't have enough sprint uh, speed and cooldown. I'm gonna still try, you know. Stay there. Can we do it? She's right on my ass. Need to kill this guy. Oof, man, that's... Difficult. I really need to kill this guy. That's all I need first. I'm here, boy. You, you, you. Not her. going the opposite direction come on dude she spotted me here no not like that we kill this guy that's all i need the game yes okay now the issue is enemies nothing else how many will get in wait for her to go back the headshot and run, run around the objects, furniture. Okay. Oh my god, we have a child zombie. You gotta be kidding me. Oh man, we cannot do it. Not enough mobility. We cannot. We don't. We just do not have enough mobility and damage. So yeah, just keep her, guys. Yeah, we, we tried. We tried though. Impossible. If we had the uh, energizer or uh, orangeizer and energy drink, we would be able to pull it off maybe. But without it, big no. That's here. Oh, evaded one. Oh man, he is fast. I think we'll skip it because we're run. Uh, we are out of energy drinks. Oh, fuck. We try. We try, guys. Oh yeah, he is fast now. Nope, we cannot. We need to upgrade our boots. We're going back. This is a big no. We need to upgrade our boots for sure. And uh, what I have here? And for real? No. Red envelopes. Uh, well, we tried. We're gonna do the. We're gonna search for the items and we'll try to upgrade our jeans if possible. Legs, because uh, this is really bad. It's just impossible to run out uh, some of the enemies.
have to check our mobility stats. But anyways, I'm just gonna be upgrading gear here, uh, searching for the gear. So if you, you know, wanna don't wanna watch anymore, so I do not waste your time if you don't wanna watch that. Uh, thank you for watching, you know. And as I said, I'm gonna leave in the description my socials, my uh, membership for the YouTube if you wanna join, so you can support me on YouTube. Uh, as I said, let me know about the prices if you think it's too expensive. And uh, yeah, I really appreciate uh, those of you who joined recently. Thank you very much, guys. Okay, let's see now. First, we're gonna scrap the items. Where's the trader? Oh, okay. We didn't have to use any of these. That's awesome. Scrap, 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 and scrap. Oh, I forgot about this. Dang, 1.1k. That's awesome. Uh, beans are for the stew. Right, make yes, you're saving that for sure. Answer, chance for these as well. Okay, mm, okay, time to look for the better legs. Plotting legs. And level 20 and 32. 20, 22. We need spin speed and, and cooldown if possible. Come on. Yeah, that's that's uh getting something like that is we currently we are currently at what yeah 39 spin speed 34 sprint duration and 32 sprint cooldown like if this was like 50 and this was like this this was like i guess this is fine but like having these two like fi at 50 if possible or close at least that would be awesome because yeah this is just uh, very hard without that yeah, we need we need those boots, man. Need to craft that. Mm. Okay. Let's see what then what we can get from the from the um, spin speed and jog speed. Maybe can we get anything from that. Everything is so hard. I guess a lot of new players. That's probably the. Yeah, that's just insane and just one going just for one uh is uh oh look at that incoming damage 22k 17 incoming that's good spin speed but then we're losing spin duration we're getting incoming damage though but 22k is Quite a lot we need for the ammo so we can boss. This is good though. I'll get that for now. What else can we get? It's bad. And that's too much. What about jog speed? I bet there is a bunch now. Actually not. Damn, interesting, interesting. Okay, well, we're gonna go look for our statistics now. Not sure if we can find any. Did it in spin speed, highly doubt. We find any. What? There is no way. There is no way, actually. 1.2k, that's cheap, man. I mean, the stats are not super high, but. And that's cheap. Look at that. Inventory mutated spin speed. And that's nice. You lose XP, but you get a mutated inventory and... Dude, give me that. What if we just go sprint speed? We can trade that as well. Just going for the sprint stats here. Because anyways, on our stats currently, we do not have damage services uh, mutated. We just have XP and infected. So that might be a good thing to do now. 
for us actually. 20 and 32. Sprint speed, sprint cooldown. That'll be awesome. 6.2k. No, that's no trade, so. And the stats are kinda well low. I mean it's low 20, yeah. I'm expecting too much, I guess. Let's see that. Yeah, that's not gonna happen. Okay, jog speed combined with spin speed, that's also viable. You know, that's not bad. And yeah, that's not the case. Okay, hey, we are upgraded our spin speed. Mutated. Good. Gonna lose some uh, dodge cooldown and spin duration here and get some spin speed. Get some incoming damage. So that's a win, in my opinion. Goes here. Go. Mm, good. Yeah, look at us. Damn, man, we're looking cool. Uh, so let's see our full stats currently. Okay, that's not that bad. Okay. We have minus one attack speed because of the leather jacket. Do one incoming damage. That's awesome for our level. 76 mutated. That's awesome as well. 36 infected. Our XP is 192, which is fine. So we lost some spin duration. We lost how much? We lost... Yeah, we lost 9. But... We gained some spin speed. We have 51, 25 spin duration, and 32 cooldown. So we are much faster now. Oh yeah, that's a, that's a big difference. Look at that. With the Orangeizer and Energy Drink, I bet we can take on Tangel easily. Okay, time to put some items on the market. We do not use, don't need. Let's see that. Guess I'll uh, as well do it with these two. You know what? We'll do it later. We'll do it later. Anyways, we'll end the episode here. Thank you all for watching. I hope you were able to learn something. And uh, I'll see you in another video of the Frontier 2. And as I said, leave in the socials down the description. If you got anything to mention or something, I'll leave it in the comments as well. I can pin it if you want, guys. Please leave your feedback on the in, uh, gameplay, on the, you know, uh, my information, how I do things, you know, and everything. Uh, and as I said, membership if you want to join. Thank you guys for watching and I wish you a great day. See you some other time. Peace, guys.